Yeah. So you can take your camera and go downstairs with it. Or we could get security to handle this. Okay, yeah, if you want to get security. Look at all these kids around here and he's saying F anyone and acting like this. Because you're recording around children and that's totally against everything on my belief. You know what? Oh. Get the f out of here with their f Go! Chad, calm down. Wow. I don't believe in filming children. We weren't filming kids. We weren't filming kids. Look, he's, he's acting up again. Hey guys, Denver Metro Audits here. We are at the Aurora Public Library and I got uh, MLH and D-Trails with me today. What's up, we're freezing, by the way. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I, uh, I forgot my SD card. I didn't know it wasn't in my camera, so I left these guys out in the cold to go get it. Hi. How are you? Good, how you doing? Good. Put your video in for it. Oh, just taking some video. Oh. Okay. Okay. Now, if you guys video me, make sure you give me on my good side. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> hey. That's really cool. You're so far so good. Okay. Dude, it's weird to see you without your glasses on. I know, man. This, this help you out, DMA? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you know when like somebody has a beard and they shave or something right. like that? Yeah. Right. This guy wants our attention. That's the youth services area? Uh-huh. That's the youth services area? Yep. So that's the children's area? Uh-huh. So I'm just letting you know where you're headed. Okay. Why would you tell me that? Well, because you're filming. Okay. You're filming minors without a consent. All right. Well, is there a law against that? Well, what I'm asking you, did you know that's what you, what you were doing? That's what I said. Okay, well, I mean, I'm not trying to let record kids, but I mean, if they're inadvertently in my camera, okay. there's nothing I can do about that. I'm just so. checking to see if you knew that. I'm just trying to okay. make sure. All right, yeah, I got you. It's actually not against the law to record people in public. Minors without their parents' consent? Yes, it yeah, is. No, it's not, sir. I'm not going to argue with you, okay, fellas. I'm just trying to. Yeah, thanks for not arguing, because I mean, it's. It's, a, it's a, the law is a law, regardless of how you interpret it. So well, policy and law is two different things, correct? Exactly. So okay. It's not against the law to record yeah, minors. But policy and law is two different things, correct? Exactly. Yeah, okay. you're right. Uh, but you said it was it is illegal to record them, right? No, I said policy and law is two different things. Have yeah, you said that it, that we're not allowed to record the juveniles? Is that what you said? I said, did you know about it? That's what I asked. I asked a question. Okay. And you said. You asked me if I knew where I was going into the youth area, right? Yeah, I was just letting you know what okay. area you were going in. That's it. Oh, okay. Okay. Thank, thanks for letting us know. Okay. <laughs> that was interesting. So this is the youth area in here that that guy was telling me about. How's it going, man? What's going on? Oh, not much. Just taking some footage over here. Uh, about what? Uh, <coughs> I don't know yet. All right. I know you have the right to record, but this is a kid's area, so yeah, little shaky for you to be recording. It's over not shaky area. at all. I mean, the law is black and white, so. <coughs> I'm not yeah, but there are children underage here. Yeah. So you can take your camera and go downstairs with it. Or we could get security to handle this. Okay, yeah, if you want to get security. So we got the guy with the blue line uh, bandana on his face. Yeah. So of course he's the one that give me crap about oh, it. Oh, of course I am. <laughs> Somebody's so we got this guy going to go get security on me because I'm, I'm in here uh, where the children are. It's a library. There's going to be children all over the place. I know they have the right to be 
No, I'm a so we got the blue line guy here, freaking out, <laughs> acting a little unprofessional, mm -hmm. getting a little irate, throwing yep. a tantrum. Yep. All right. Yeah. Okay. Yep. This guy's getting real upset. I am getting upset. Cave here. And he went in to go talk to somebody if that's a boss or something over there. A boss? I guess he's like, hey Karen, <laughs> we got some <laughs> guy with a camera in here. But uh, you know, the thing is, MLH, it's like that I said in one of my other videos, it's like, okay, when I go to the park and I record my nephew sports games, am I breaking the law? No. I mean, and we're not in here trying no. to, to record kids anyways. I came in here and I put my camera straight on him. I wasn't right. recording kids. <laughs> But if, if a kid is inadvertently in my camera, that's not illegal. It's not yeah. a crime. And I heard him go up there all huffy to the, the security guard, and I was like, oh boy, we got one of those. We got a, what do they call it, a Darren? <laughs> a Darren? Yeah, 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 he's a Darren here. Yeah, I got a camera too, buddy. Yeah, go ahead, it's well, fine. Yeah. You can take pictures, you're not afraid of a camera. And say hi to YouTube, because well, well, you're f live. Welcome to the, uh, the 1A movement, man. <sighs> okay. Well, you guys so we got so we got this guy who's using the f word uh, around children, uh, and he just was concerned with me recording children. Yet he's using the f word around children. And he's got his camera on some kids in the back there. I don't have camera on the kids. I'm actually. I don't have our camera it. on the kids either. I never did. Can you please leave, or I'll call the f***ing police and have them get you out of here. Look at all these kids around here. He's saying f <laughs> and acting so like sad, this. Huh? Because you're recording around children, and that's totally hey. against everything. I'm a belief. You know what? Oh, get the f out of here with their f shit! Go! Chad, Whoa. Dad, calm down, Whoa. Chad. There wow. I guess we just had a mom. She just complained that you filmed her kid back here. No. We weren't filming children. I never even filmed a child. Okay, so I came in here and was record recording him. Oh, okay, so that's what I don't know. So he she made contact. Yeah, no. she's she's calling the Aurora police because she said you're filming. Okay, okay, well we'll wait till the police get here then. That's just ridiculous. Show just show them. Can you show them? Can show film? what? Just show the officer what you let her know what you filmed. Yeah, I mean. Do you guys know exactly what you're filming? It's okay. Oh. It's okay. Well, it's a public space and public photography oh, is constitutionally protected. Activity. That's true. That's true. They're just coming to just, you get know, photography of the, the building. And you know a child. There are people so, right now are on edge. Here's just the had thing. A kid abducted. They don't. Know yeah, man. We, we never so. were recording I, children, yeah, even though we have the legal right to. We weren't yeah. going to record children. We were recording him, I, and he was upset that we were recording. So I was wondering why all the kids were like. <laughs> Yeah. Well, yeah, probably because he's so yelling good. and screaming at us. Uh, no, they have he, three gentlemen or whatever. What I just was told. I didn't, I saw you guys, but I was just told there's three creepy so guys in the back in children's area filming. You guys, it's 2021. I understand that. Yeah, People are, are on yeah. edge. Pete parents Well, are that guy was using the F word several times around the children, I, yet he's part, concerned. We, will, we definitely will address that, but yeah. at this point, I'm addressing the situation so. of parents are feeling like they see three guys filming their kids. See. That is a that is a kid. She is a child. Do not film her. Man, well, don't tell us to not film ch children, man. That's not you can't tell us to not film children, okay? We already told you I mean, that no, we're not here to do that. Children, we're already here. We already told you we're not here to do that. But don't give us unlawful directives like that. We're, we're tell if you okay? want to film what you want to film. You yeah, we can film anything that we can see in here, man. You have a great side though when you do, okay? Thank you. Well, you had a great side until you started giving me unlawful directives like that. Okay. In the beginning, you were cool. Well, you can't come back this way. So. Paul would never go back there. All right. Well, you guys have a great day. <laughs> I'll be back. Okay. So we got, of course, we got the the blue line flag guy who's using the f bomb around the kids because he's upset with me be having a camera in there, even though he was recording around the kids too. He said we were on YouTube live. So. And uh, uh, trails and this. Apparently he's some sort of uh, worker for this place. We have to wait for the cops to show up. So they called the police on us. And we thought, you know, we had a couple of places to go. We stopped in the library first. We thought for sure this would be the, the least confrontational one, but you know me and libraries, guys. So. 
Bakery. Uh, uh, I'm What's live up? with DMA. What's up? There's DMA. <laughs> What's up? Dude, um, they, so the, the, that guy was upset that we were in there recording around kids. We weren't recording the kids, we were just recording around them. And he freaked out. Of course, he has the blue line flag mask on. Right. And then he's over there using the F bomb, F in this. I know, the that F was crazy. Uh, around the kids, too. I you know. You just have a camera. And then he comes out and just records us and says we're on YouTube Live. I'm like, great. Kids, I told like, him, great. Welcome to the 1A movement. And it's like, dude, <laughs> he's like, well, I'm not recording kids, he said. And we're like, well, we're not either. You know, right. that guy is just, he shouldn't be working there. He shouldn't be working around children. Absolutely if he's, if he's not. over there acting like that, he grabbed, what did he grab his bottle and threw it and started yelling I at thought him. he was going to, I, I honestly, DMA, I thought he was going to throw it at me. I thought he was going to, I mean, oh, luckily there's three of us because yeah. it could be like a Belmar library incident where it <laughs> turns into a mob against us or something. Maybe. I mean, this was crazy. Uh, uh, the police are coming. The police are on their way. So that's why I went live. Just so you guys down the stairs. Uh, this dude just went absolutely ballistic. Um, he, it looked like he was going to throw his water bottle. He broke his water bottle. Uh, Did he break it? On the floor, is it all, is there water on the ground? Let's go check it out. And, yeah. and, and I'll show you guys the aftermath of this. This was... Oh, here he is. Um, this is the guy right here, guys. They have to save four children. We don't even have a policy. But oh. hold on. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. I'm uh, the manager of public services okay. uh, for the whole library thing. All right. Is there anything we can do to help you? Uh, actually, yeah. I would like um, to know why he went ballistic and was using a lot of profane language around the kids in this area. I mean, because you were is that filming policy? kids, and I don't believe in filming children. We weren't filming kids. <laughs> we weren't filming kids. Oh, look, he's, oh, he's acting up again. This Put that on your YouTube well, channel. Dude. Don't f***ing get you shut down like that, you c Wow. Someone needs to go home today, I think. Okay, so I, I would be surprised if that guy still has his job after this. I mean, that's I mean, just that ridiculous. That is absolutely crazy that they hire people like that to work in, in kids and all things. Um, just crazy. Can I get so your name, ma'am, again? My name? Oh, Joanna McNeil. Joanna McNeil, okay. Mm -hmm. Manager of Public Services. Gotcha. So you're like the manager of this branch here? Um, I'm the manager of all the branches, so I'm not the executive director. She, I report to her, okay. and all the branch supervisors report to me. Gotcha. So at Central, Martin Luther King, Hoffman, the other branches. Do you happen to be here today? No, I'm always here. So the admin, okay. this, is the, this, is the this is the building that the admin is. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we're upstairs on the second floor. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah that, I, uh, I came in on the tail end of it, but I just saw him throw his bottle and he was yelling. This is crazy, guys. Accusing us of things that we're not even doing. And well, now the police are called, I believe. Yeah, the police yeah. have been called on us for some reason. I don't, I don't quite get it. I mean, if anything, this guy made threatening gestures at me, which I have recorded on camera. Um, and I actually, I'm still shaking. Uh, my adrenaline's pumping too. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think we've all got a lot of adrenaline. Going. I thought that guy was gonna uh, just attack us. You're shaking. You look smaller than you. Really? Okay. Are you serious? So. That's it. Excuse me. No, no comments. Really? Okay. Everybody just get. Did you get just? Back to did she work just say what I thought? Okay. I think she said. Yeah, yeah she did. Job. These people are allowed to film in here. It's a public place. Wow. Everything. So we're just gonna let them film. This is, and we'll just get on with our work. Control here in Aurora. Okay. Thank you. This is crazy. Mm -hmm. Appreciate that, ma'am. Okay. There's one person. Maybe that's probably yeah. why you're in charge. <laughs> well, I'm not yeah. totally in charge, but. but mostly. Um, wow. I think I have more experience in libraries. And yeah. so we got this lady over here who just can't stand the fact that we're in here either. You know, we're just peaceful that people. That's all. We're just uh, we just came in here because we're doing a little story in the library, and that's it. Yeah. You know? We're not coming in here to record kids. I mean, this, I, find, I you know, not that it's illegal to record kids. I mean, I record my nephew's sports games all the time, and that's not illegal, this right? Is so the only sane person in this library it, it appears now. This is crazy. She's like, in, I'm sorry, ma'am. What was your name again? Joanna. Joanna. Thank you. Joanna. <laughs> Her name's Joanna too. My gosh, that's crazy. We we uh, we know uh, another Joanna at uh, Belmar Library. Oh. She's in Jefferson County. Yeah. Um, she was a manager over there too. So that's just funny. It's a little inside joke. <laughs> yeah. It's okay. Uh, but you're much better than she was, so. Oh, really? Yeah, we like you. <laughs> I mean, is there anything else? You don't have any 
questions? Is there anything we can do to help you? Uh, no, I don't think so. I mean, if, if the police get here and you want to just tell them that, um, you know, yeah. we're allowed to be in here and stuff. And Absolutely. we're not trying to hang out forever and cause a scene. We just want to peacefully no, record I'll, and we'll I'll be on our way. Surely. Yeah, I'll yeah. let them know. Okay. Maybe 10 minutes. Yeah, I think they probably know minutes. anyway. But. You're right. All right. Well, thanks, Joanna. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thank you for your uh, candor. I appreciate that, Joanna. You're welcome. That, that's refreshing to have uh, Joanna here that, that knows the law and is respectful. Guys, he literally had the water bottle like he was going to hit me. Dude. Like, he was shaking mad. Bad. He was so mad. I said, I'm going to go home. I'm going to go home and I'm going to play video games, right? Uh -huh. And then I was like, well, hey, DMA, do you want to go out? Uh, D Trails, you want to go out, you know, go out and do some stuff. And this happens. Holy hell, guys. It is absolutely insane what, what happened here. I, I'm still kind of shaking, bro. Like, whew. Yeah. I mean, I, I literally thought that that guy was going to throw that water bottle, bottle and hit I, me. I think he wanted to. And I think if we were out on the streets, he definitely would have. Um, and, and here's the thing, guys, that he, he was upset about us recording kids. We weren't recording kids. But anyways, regardless if you're recording a kid, his, his, uh, his worries are overblown, okay? Yeah. Kids are recorded every time they leave their house just like you and I are, right? right. It's, it's no bearing. You know, like I said, I record my nephew's sports games, and I don't have their consent. They're in public, right? right. We're not using this footage for nefarious use. We're just here taking a tour of the <laughs> lobby. And, you know, if, my, if I don't have kids, but if I had kids or my nephews or whatever, and, there was a man with a camera that, I mean, who cares? Right, it's not a big right. deal, man. You're recorded constantly. Security cameras in use. So we got security cameras in use, MLH. Okay, good. So uh, the, the kids are being recorded by them, right? Right. Yeah, you can see. You know, hey, how's it going, man? Good. Look at that. That's the way you Yeah, he waves at us with a smile, right? No big deal. Oh, the cops are here, guys. Did you just tell them? Did they come in here? Uh, they just came into the lobby area and they, they even, I said you don't need to come in, but they already knew. They were telling us that you're totally, perfectly entitled okay. to come in here. And Okay. Filming. Is there is there is there a, like a complaint process for that employee? I have no idea his name or. Um, we have complaint cards, and yeah. you would start with that. Can we get three complaint forms, please? Three. Yep. Yeah, appreciate it. Because I'm new, I don't know exactly where they are. Okay, okay no problem. <laughs> so Joanna's been great, guys. There's the the police, the Aurora police are out there. Um, let's go take a look. So they they came in deep, but. They uh, left right away, so, and they already knew the law too, so. The, the security guards are the ones that uh, called the police on us, so they came with four officers. These guys seem to be cool. They gave me a couple waves. Um, I know a lot of guys don't like Aurora uh, cops, but these guys are cool. They gave me some waves and some head nods, you know? So they were okay. Yeah, they were cool. They, they already knew what time it was, so. Hey, Joanna, we're, we're about to head out of here, but uh, we just wanted to get Chad's name. Can we get his last name? To be honest, I don't even know his last name, and that's okay. super honest truth. Okay. Okay guys, I feel like Joanna is protecting Chad right here. She doesn't know his last name, but she could have easily found out. And if any of us had acted the way that he did, we would have been leaving in handcuffs. So how come she didn't invite the police in to come have Chad arrested? Um, how come he was allowed to remain in the back in solitude until we left? Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, can you tell us who was the individual that called the police on us? I do not know. It, you know? it wasn't anybody here. It wasn't anybody here. It was a patron. Yes. Okay. I think it was a parent. A parent. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, thank you guys. Okay, you're welcome. We really appreciate you. Just drop them off at the front desk when you want. Okay. Okay. Bye bye. Have a good thank Thanksgiving. You. You, too. you too. Thank you.
All right, we're gonna get out of here. All right, you guys stay safe. You too. So, uh, have a happy Thanksgiving. You as well. And uh, just hope they, hopefully that you learned today that you know, it's not illegal for us to record children, okay? Yeah, we did. Thank you for okay. that. Okay, all right, have a great one. You too. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. Take care. All right, guys, one education at a time, like I always say. Education at a time. This is the craziest I've ever seen anybody in any library go. Even more than Belmar? Yeah, I guess it was. More than Belmar. More than Belmar. Bro. But he, he wasn't actually physically assaulting us. It was more he was just acting completely irate and right. throwing stuff right. and cussing. Yeah, Bel I mean, it's comparable. And there were kids that were really upset, not by our behavior, but by this employee's behavior. Thankfully, Joanna works here because she de-escalated everything. Um, this is not the Joanna from the Belmar uh, <laughs> Definitely uh, Library. This is uh, Joanna from the Aurora Public Library here. Even not knowing the context of what was going on, that guy was obviously out of control. I mean, he was physically shaking from anger. He's cursing while there were still kids around at that point. No one had cleared out of the area really at that point. He's insulting us. Just completely unprofessional behavior. Completely just childish really I, I mean i guess in a sense he should have been in the kid zone that gentleman is completely unprofessional uh doesn't have any business working around kids uh doesn't know the law ignorant of the law like i always say guys one education at a time and that's what we're here to do i went and talked to that lady i said hopefully now you'll know that it's not against the law for us to record juveniles and she actually her pride and ego wasn't in the way and she said yeah we did learn that um, and so that was great. That was a win for us. Um, the next thing we need to do is just make sure that that guy gets fired because yeah. uh, I, I'm not going to stop uh, until that, I know that guy is no longer employed.